thanks for joining me. This is your reading for Monday, the 23rd of March. So the new week here starting. Let's see what's coming up for you. And I'm loving using these cards at the moment. And with this background, it makes me feel like I'm in some tropical kind of um, straw hut doing a reading, which I love. <laughs> I say that like I've done it. I have not tried that yet. I will have to put that on my list of um, things to do. So I'll have to schedule a, a flight to Thailand or something so I can do that. Okay. Let's see what's coming up here. And we've got three cards in reverse. And the reversals have been quite um, prolific recently and lately, which means that the energy is kind of cutting corners and going all over the place. So let's see what this is. First card is the Ace of Swords in reverse, which really represents a type of uh, negative idea or being blocked from an inspiration that wants to come in. Then it's the Nine of Wands, little kitty cat there with some armor hiding behind a tree. And really what this means is um, that you feel kind of cornered in some way. Because it's in reverse, it means if you are able to drop the faulty ideas or if you are able to unblock yourself, you can come out of the situation you're in. So for instance, um, right, uh, da, da, da. let's say... I'm in a relationship I don't want to be in. Um, you know, it's no longer good. The reasons we got into the relationship isn't there anymore. And I just have no idea how to get out of it. I've been trying to figure figure it out for weeks. I haven't been able to change anything. If I open myself up, so rather than throwing things at the problem and, and forcing an idea to come, I let it go. I sit back. I maybe go away for a couple of days. I meditate. I relax. I unblock myself, I let that inspiration come in, and it shows me the way out. So maybe one of these ones will come down, and I'll start to see a way out of this situation. And then the eight of ones in reverse, you can see this pigeon kind of falling down, okay, and, and about to crash. If I let that inspiration come through, I'm not going to crash and kind of um, fail to take flight, I will actually be able to lift off and get out of that situation. So again, you don't have all the answers. You've got to appeal to spirit for the answers and that will help you resolve this situation. One, nine is 10 and eight is 18. One and eight is nine, spirituality. Nine represents completion through spirituality. So again, very similar message to a couple of days ago, I think it was Saturday, when the answer is appeal to spirit and get in touch with your spiritual truth to find the answers in life. Have a wonderful day. If you'd like a private reading with me, get in touch via my website, Gregory Scott, and remember to subscribe to the channel.